Life on the Red Horse Ranch. <laughs> When we last visited the Red Horse Ranch, we found Tenderfoot in a rather unhappy frame of mind. It was then he found that it was not he, but Alabama who had won Rose Carter's affections. Alabama has not yet learned of Tenderfoot's conversation with Rose, and he's down in the corral with the boys of the Red Horse outfit, looking forward to the big rodeo soon to be held in Danville. kicks like a face there when you get him riled. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's your turn now, Bob. Yeah. Shall we let that longhorn out of the corral? Yeah. Sure, I can bulldog any snorting steer on the Red Horse Ranch. Let me ride your horse, Alabama. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you keep away from Red. He'll bite your left ear off. <laughs> ride Prince there. All right. I'll carry off every prize in that rodeo if I have to ride Cookie's Burrow after. <laughs> hey, hey, you get busy here. I didn't give you boys the afternoon off to sit up there on the fence. Hurry up there, Bob. Get that horse saddled up. The steer's getting mighty frisky in there. Tex will calm him down for you. Come on, Tex. <laughs> When the cattle are prowling and the coyotes are howling under the western sky, the cowboy is singing, his spurs are jingling, and down the trail he rides. Many days he's a dawning and he wakes up yawning, making his coffee strong. 
Makes his bed in a roll Down the trail he will stroll Starts the day with this song say much, but he's taking it all in. You think you could throw a steer like that, Dewey? Of course I could. Let me show you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. We'll wait until next year for your part of the show. Yeah. Hey, okay. I promised Hank he could count on you boys for music at the rodeo. I hope you're getting ready for it. Yeah. Boy, I'll say. Shucks, ain't you heard my Taterbug band yet? Huh? What's that, Alabama? Well, uh, Arizona plays on that tater bug mandolin he's got there. And <laughs> Idaho beats on that doghouse. And Monty <laughs> plays on that undergrown guitar. Let her go, boy. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Seems to have something on his mind. Aren't you caught are y'all down here practicing for the rodeo? Yeah, that's right, Cookie. We're taking you over there and you and the grease pig contest. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think you could catch a grease pig? I don't know about that. What do you want me to catch a grease pig for? Well, there's a mighty good prize for the winner in that grease pig contest. No, sir, I don't want to catch no grease up pig. I'm in in the world. I'll win in that rodeo. He'll win a prize. Oh, uh, yeah. well, what in tarnation can whirlwind do, Cookie? He can run like lightning when he gets started. He practically flies. <laughs> yeah, where's Tenderfoot? I'm counting on trying him out in one of these events over there. He ain't worth nothing to the Red Horse Ranch to be doing. Well, I think he wandered up to the house a little while ago. Didn't seem to be feeling so good. Well. Come on, boys. Let's show Mr. Carter what else we got lined up for that rodeo. Yeah. Come down off that fence, Monty. We're going to yeah. sing that New River Train. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Riding on that New River Train. Riding on that New River Train. Yes, sir. This is what she said. Said I'd rather see you dead than riding on that New River Train. Darling, you can't love but one. Why can't you? Darling, you can't love but one. Well, can't Cheyenne. love but one and have any fun. Oh, darling, you can't love but one. Riding on that new river train. Riding on that new river train. This is what she said. Said I'd rather see you dead than riding on that new river train. Oh, well, darling, you can't love two. Well, tell us, Bob. Oh, darling, you can't love two. How come, boy? Oh, yeah. you can't love two and still be true. Oh, oh. darling, you can't <laughs> love two. <laughs> Riding on that new river train. Riding on that new river train. This is what you said, said I'd rather see you dead than riding on that new river train. <laughs> you can't love three. Darling, there you ain't can't be three. You ain't carefully oh, three, and they'll stay up the email. Oh, Wilding Day, you ain't carefully three. <laughs> Riding on that new river train. Riding on that new river train. This is what she said, said I'd rather see you dead than right on that new river train. Riding on that new river train. This is what she said, said I'd rather see you dead than right on that new river train. Darling, you can't love four. Yes, I can. Darling, you can't love four. Well, I can too. You can't love four and love me anymore. Oh. Darling, you can't love four. <laughs> Riding on that new river train. Whoa, whoa. Riding on that new river train. Whoa. This is what she said. Said I'd rather see you dead than riding on that new river train. Come on, Arizona. Darling, you can't love five. Get low down. Darling, you 
Well, love pie. Can't love pie, man. Still stay alive. Oh, darling, you can't love pie. Riding on that new river train. Whoa, whoa. Riding on that new river train. This is what she said. Said I'd rather see you dead than riding on that new river train. Yes, sir, Mr. Carter. That New River train and my red winning the horse race is going to be the two biggest events of that whole rodeo. Hey, uh, come to think of it, Alabama, I want you to keep training red. Yes, sir. That'll be a mighty good horse running again, yeah? What horse around here can even hold a candle to red? Well, I ain't saying nothing about no horse around here, Alabama. What's that? There's talk going around that Steve Bradford's counting on importing a horse from the east for that rodeo. Oh, is that, oh, right? is that right. so? Well, we proved Bradford ain't going to get in our way once we set out to do something. That's right. Yeah, he ain't set foot on a red horse since we run him off. Well, right. now, now, boys, don't go looking for trouble. It's all settled between Bradford and me. <laughs> he didn't get hold of the red horse ranch. We know now there's a chance of there being oil on the place. Yeah. Well, I guess Miss Rose is coming down to join in on the fun. Rose? Alabama here? Oh, sure I am, Rose. Oh. Idaho's getting the search single on that steer. He's counting on riding it. What do you think? Alabama, <laughs> come here. I've got to talk to you a minute. Why, sure, Rose. Rose, Rose is there anything wrong? Well, I'll tell you a little later, Dad. Well, uh, but what could be worrying you, Rose? Oh, it's about Tenderfoot. Tenderfoot? What are you talking about? Well, he's gone. He just rode away. Rode away? Tenderfoot? Well, where to? Well, I don't know. But he says he's not coming back, and, oh, I'm so worried about him, Alabama. Well, why didn't he tell me? Say, what's this all about? Oh, Alabama, I don't know, but, oh, I'm afraid he thinks he's not wanted. What? Well, he was up to the house last night, and, oh, Alabama, I never dreamed that he, he felt that way toward me. Well, I just couldn't encourage him because... Well, it wouldn't be fair. Well, that silly young kid. I'll bet I know what's in the back of his mind. But what are we going to do, Alabama? Oh, I feel terrible oh, about it. Oh, don't feel that way. I wouldn't have had that happen for anything in the whole world. Well, don't worry yourself, Rose. It looks like I've got a little riding to do. You mean that you're going after him? Why, sure. Red and me's going to bring Tenderfoot back to the Red Horse Ranch. Oh. So Tenderfoot rode away, fearing that he stood in Alabama's way with Rose Carter. We hope Alabama can persuade him to return to the Red Horse Ranch. <laughs>